Hello guys and welcome back for a brand new review. If you are new to the channel, please make sure you're gonna subscribe. You can also give me a follow on Instagram to see exactly what I'm gonna review in the next few days. In today's video, we're gonna have a look at a new version for the very well-known Air Force One. let's go ahead and also take them out of the box guys so this one being an Air Force One we're gonna have your usual box which will be in this uh, black color we're also gonna have uh, written here on the top Nike Air Force One and rather than that we're just uh, gonna have the actual sizing tag here on the side so let's just uh, take them out guys so in today's video guys uh, we're gonna have a look at the last uh, release for the Air Force One 07 Premium This uh, new version guys for the Air Force One was released uh, here in the UK at the end of uh, February for a retail price of £125 and this one as you can see will uh, bring out some uh, new elements which I guess uh, it's trying to revive the, this uh, model uh, slightly. So let's go ahead and also do a small breakdown of this one guys. So as you can see for most of the upper we're gonna have this uh, white leather material which will have uh, your normal panels uh, as in the normal Air Force One. So starting here at the front uh, we're gonna have this uh, perforation uh, holes uh, which will be on top of the actual uh, tobo section. And covering the whole part of the tobo section we're gonna have this uh, white leather so nothing special here. As in for the actual lacing system we're gonna have your normal punch out holes which uh, will use these uh, white flat laces and as you can see at the bottom of the laces guys we're gonna have this uh, very nice uh, colored uh, tag with Air Force One written on it so this one it's uh, quite nice and just underneath these laces guys uh, we're gonna have uh, a new material for this uh, tongue so this one will use this uh, ripstop material and will be in this uh, black color and also as you can see at the top we're also gonna have this uh, red tag with the Nike swoosh and air uh, written on it and uh, one thing that it's uh, completely new for this one guys is that uh, this uh, tongue uh, it actually has uh, a zip pouch uh, inside so you can uh, store uh, I guess some money or even a key. I guess uh, not too much will fit here otherwise it will uh, start to be slightly a bit uh, inconvenient for the top of your foot. So this one uh, it's nice I'm not entirely sure if I'm ever gonna use that but I guess for younger people which uh, they don't want to lose money or the actual key that will be just fine. And as we are uh, talking about uh, new stuff on this Air Force One guys you can see that on the lateral and also on the medial side we're gonna have some uh, Nike swooshes in a smaller uh, sizing than usual. So this one will be in this uh, black leather and as you can see on the lateral side we're also gonna have this uh, detachable uh, swoosh carabiner which uh, has also a bottle opener here uh, underneath. So this one uh, in case uh, you are not a big fan of you can just uh, uh, pull it out and uh, use it uh, for whatever you want. To be honest uh, this one looks quite interesting and as you can see it also has a Nike Air Force One 82 and swoosh written uh, on the bottom side. As we go uh, to the back part of the shoe guys uh, we're gonna have the same uh, white leather material which uh, here at the top part of the heel section uh, will also have this uh, black leather which uh, has the Nike swoosh and the Air uh, embroidered in this white color. But as you go inside guys uh, you can see that we're gonna have your normal lining in this white color which underneath uh, has a decent amount of padding and also at the bottom we're gonna have this uh, black uh, foam insole which also has this uh, Nike swoosh and the lettering uh, imprinted at the heel section. And now guys uh, we can go to this uh, rubber outsole in this uh, white color which as you can see it's also stitched to the actual shoe. And this one will also have this uh, air written here uh, on the lateral side of the heel section. This one is actually quite a high one. 
but in the same time I don't feel that this one it's uh, adding a lot of weight to the overall shoe. And now guys uh, we can finish with this rubber outsole which has your standard pattern for all of the Air Forces one. So this one it's uh, completely unchanged for uh, a lot of years. We're also gonna have the Nike lettering in a swoosh here in the midfoot. As in for the actual sizing guys, uh, for this one I decided to go with a half size down and that will be mainly because I have a skinny feet and if I went with my uh, true to size uh, I know that uh, here at the front of the shoe I have uh, too much room and I don't actually like that but I guess for uh, people with uh, normal feet uh, true to size will be just fine and I guess uh, depending on how wide your feet will be you can go with uh, true to size or uh, just uh, try to go with a half size up so overall guys this uh, new version for the Air Force one which is called the premium it's actually almost the same shoe as the previous uh, Air Force one released we just have this uh, Nike swooshes in a slightly smaller uh, sizing which uh, to be honest I kind of like it uh, and uh, given that uh, we are receiving this uh, bottle opener which is uh, attached here on the side and this uh, zipped pouch I guess uh, the actual price it's uh, justified uh, in a way but rather than that we are just uh, getting the normal Air Force One which to be honest uh, I'm not a big fan of and that would be mainly because uh, I'm a skinny guy and this one for me feels that it's slightly a bit too bulky so uh, yeah guys uh, this was my my unboxing and reviewing of this uh, new release for the Air Force One in this uh, premium version. I really hope uh, you've enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to press the like button maybe also subscribe to the channel. You can also leave some comments in the comment section down below. Also don't forget to give me a follow on Instagram to see exactly what I'm gonna review for you guys in the next few days and as always I will see you in my next one. Thanks for watching!